a young Cameroonian uh, graduate student at the University of Westminster in London has created a general certificate of education application. The digital tool provides examination resources to secondary school students preparing for their GCE exams across Cameroon with an easy and intelligent way to find exam resources. I spoke to Felix Safumingia, founder of the Cameroonian Best GCE Guide app for more insight. Welcome to Africa 54. Thank you so much, sir. It's a pleasure for me. You are a young uh, tech entrepreneur in uh, Cameroon. Uh, tell us a little bit about uh, uh, some of the things that you've been able to do. I'm the founder of Large Solutions, which is a tech startup where we are helping uh, the public to embrace the digital age. And we outsource services such as web development, application development. Um, so far, we have been able to work with uh, organizations in Cameroon, across Cameroon, to be able to be their digital solutions and uh, platforms. What you're working on could potentially change uh, the education curriculum, the education system uh, in uh, Cameroon, because uh, a lot of young people are actually buying into what you're trying to do. That's true. So one of our projects is the Cameroon DC Guide app. We actually took in interest in the education sector. Um, I noticed that students are facing the problem of difficulty access to exam resources. And back then, after noticing this problem, me and my team, we tried to brainstorm on how we can be able to solve this problem with the use of IT. And this led us to developing the Cameroon GC Guide app. Now, the Cameroon GC Guide app is an innovative app, for example, where students can find past questions, exam resources. And we noticed that back then in school, students could only find these resources in libraries. So what happens as a student, you want to study at home? So this led us to developing this app. And after development, we put these past questions, we put these resources in the app, and students could download from Google Play Store. And say, we interest you to know that today he has helped over 20,000 students who are making use of this application across Cameroon. Uh, is this something that uh, is spread out across the country or in the region where you are? It's something which is across the nation because just from the comfort of your home, you can be able to download this application from Google Play Store. So it's something which is widely used across the country. And for our impact in early uh, 2018, when we had a crisis in the Angophone regions, students have been able to make use of this application to still find exam resources and to still study for their exam. What role can a technology uh, play in the education sector in Cameroon? I think technology has a great role, for example, because looking at some of the problems which we have, we have faced in the past, for example, when COVID came, schools were closed, um, it will interest you to know that some technology platforms which were existing by this time, like for example, our platform was was being widely used to to to, to solve the problem which was at hand. That is, students facing difficulty to have a, their resources, to have classes, but platforms, but using technology, were available for students to still be able to. Uh, take their classes, get lectures, find uh, uh, content, uh, their past questions, for example, and still study for their exams at the end of the academic year. So I believe technology has a great role. Um, recently, last year, we are extending our solution to be able to provide uh, exam resources for those preparing for concourse, that is professional exams across Cameroon. So this is how, uh, for example, we are using technology to solving to innovating the educational sector in Cameroon. How secure is your, your platform? Uh, you're talking about an uh, exam. Uh, a lot of people would be like, hey, I can hack into that and maybe get those exams and, you know, get an A. Our platform is very secure because we have a powerful team on ground. And we try to make sure that we are the ones who have access to the platform. Like we do, the, we upload the content, and the students at their end just have to download and then do have access to this uh, uh, content from their phone. So we have full access to the platforms. The internet, uh, internet is very expensive uh, in Cameroon. How many people? Uh, are able to access uh, this internet so that uh, they can access some of these uh, uh, classes. Uh, the uh, amazing question. Uh, it's interesting to, for you to know that this solution actually started as an offline platform. 
meaning that once you download from the internet, you may need little or no uh, internet connections, for example, for, to be able to load the content. Um, our idea, our goal was that students should be able to make use of the application with or without internet connection so this has always been our goal how much content do you have on those applications it's content for for every domain and with time we keep updating our system our database on a daily basis uh, felix uh, thank you so much uh, for your time thank you so much sir.